on English presents commas and linkers. If you want to become a good writer in English, you must stop and pay attention to punctuation. Not only can punctuation change the meaning of what you want to say, but it is also one of the most powerful tools when it comes to writing. As a rule, you should use a comma only if it will make a sentence easier to read or to make the meaning clear by preventing ambiguities. For example, why is the comma useful in this sentence? As a general rule, when sentences are joined together with linkers, such as and, or, and but, commas are not necessary, provided that both verbs have the same subject. When the verbs have a different subject, a comma is more usual. Commas are generally used when a dependent clause begins the sentence. When the dependent clause follows the main clause, commas are optional. However, as English is a very objective language, it would sound more natural to use fewer commas. But there are some cases when commas must be used. For example, after and around some linking words. Here are some more examples of linkers followed by commas. Now, have you ever heard of the Oxford comma? If you want to improve on your ability to use punctuation, keep on watching the videos in this playlist. Want to know more? Subscribe to On English Online on YouTube. Thanks for watching!